Welcome back to the 123 Loadboard YouTube channel. I'm your host, Lauren Metzen, and today, you guessed it, it's all about record keeping and managing your paperwork to help you stay organized. Let's face it, there are very few people who actually enjoy doing paperwork. It's nonetheless an essential responsibility for truck drivers. This video will show you how to get all your carrier related documents, receipts, bill of ladings, proof of deliveries, any document really, directly into your 123 Loadboard account so that you can organize all your loads, get paid faster, and access the information you need when you need it most. Let's dive in and keep in mind, you can jump to specific sections in this video using the timestamps listed in the description below. Are your day-to-day -day trucking operations taking a toll when it comes to managing all your paperwork? If so, the 123 Loadboard's My Documents tool is the solution you need. Simply put, My Documents is a free tool available on 123 Loadboard's website and mobile app that allows users to store files digitally and securely for future reference. Having well-organized files allows you to access them within seconds. Let's start by taking a closer look by hopping onto our free mobile app. Afterwards, we'll jump on over to our website to show you how everything is nicely synchronized between platforms and devices. Also, if you haven't downloaded our mobile app yet, we've included the links in the description below for both our Android and iOS versions. As you can see, I'm currently signed into the 123 Loadboard mobile app. To head over to the My Documents tool, simply navigate to the More option in the menu at the bottom right. From there, select the My Documents tool. You'll see two default folders that are available when you first open the tool. One for your carrier documents, such as Insurance, Authority, W9, and one folder for your unsorted miscellaneous documents. Start by clicking the Add Document button, and you'll have three options. In this example, we'll be scanning a document, but you can also choose to upload a photo or file. Click Scan Document and capture the file you want to add. Here, we're uploading a liability insurance certificate and ensuring that each corner is visible. You can also rotate the image as needed, edit the brightness, edit the contrast, and apply a gray or black and white filter. When done, click OK. If your document has multiple pages, you can add more using the plus sign at the top right. Click Next. Now, we need to give this document a name. Let's type Insurance. Next, select a folder. As this is Insurance, we select the Carrier Documents folder. And lastly, we select the type of document. Let's select Liability Insurance. When done, click Create Document. And now, a new document has been added to the Carrier Documents folder. Clicking into the folder, we'll see the insurance document. The Options icon to the right gives us the ability to send, view, rename, change folder, change type, download, or even delete the file if needed. The most important is the ability to send, as brokers and shippers often request carrier documentation for onboarding purposes. You can send by simply selecting the document or documents you want to send and attach the document. The next screen allows you to send to Thunder Funding, our factoring partner, for when you need to get paid faster. But in this example, we want to send this insurance certificate to a broker. So we select Other and enter their details and click Send. Please note that you can send by email or fax. No charges apply for either option. If you decide that you don't need to send the document, remember to remove it from your Send cart. Let's head back to the beginning. In this example, we'll upload a fuel receipt on a load that was hauled. Start by clicking Add Document, then Scan it. Ensure the corners are nicely captured. Then click OK. Then click Next. As this fuel receipt is from a specific load that was hauled, enter Fuel as its name, then create a new folder using the Add Folder icon at the top right. You can name this anything you want. But in our case, the load was hauled from Chicago, Illinois to Dallas, Texas. So it makes most sense to have Illinois to Texas as the folder name. Next, you need to select the type of document. Let's click on Fuel Receipt. Now that all the fields are entered, click Create Document. The new folder along with all uploaded documents are now nicely digitized in your own personalized electronic filing cabinet. Keep in mind of the following tips. First, at any time, you can change the default sorting option from date to alphabetical to source. Likewise, you can change your preferred view from folders to date 
to type of files. This is a great way to quickly locate specific documents. Second, you can create folders for every load you haul, even if you book the load on another load board or directly with a shipper. Having all your documents in one centralized location will help keep you organized and save you a great deal of time. And the last tip, and I would go as far as saying a key feature of my documents, is that the tool allows you to attach documents to any load found on 123 load board. Let me show you an example to elaborate further. Start by searching for a load using the search option at the bottom. Find a load, click on it to view details, and scroll down and click the status bar. From this screen, you can contact the broker or shipper and then proceed to booking the load. Once booked, you need to confirm the load details and schedule the pickup. Typically at this time, you will have the rate confirmation in hand that you can upload here. Start by clicking the options icon at the top right and then add new document. Then scan, ensure the corners are nicely captured, click OK, then Next. Enter a document name. In this example, we'll use rate confirmation. As for the folder name, it already has a default name that can always be renamed later. Last, enter the type of document and click Create. Now head on back to the load by clicking the back icon. Once you picked up the load, you can upload the bill of lading, lumpers, etc. If you would like a fuel advance, request one here. Or to get more information, click the info icon. Once the load is on route and has been delivered, update the statuses accordingly. Then you can upload the proof of delivery here. And of course, you can always request to get paid faster through our exclusive factoring partner, Thunder Funding. A quick note, you'll see all your uploaded documents at the bottom of the status section. Heading back to the load details, you will also see your uploaded documents stored there as well. Another way to access your documents is through the standalone My Documents tool, as was showcased earlier in this video. Opening the tool, we'll see a new folder for the load we just booked and all the documents related to that load. Having the ability to view and manage documents is paramount to ensuring that you remain organized. So to quickly summarize the key benefits of my documents, it allows you to capture, upload, and store your documents electronically in a secure and centralized location, attach documents to any load to stay organized, send carrier-related documents for quicker onboarding, and last but not least, get paid faster on your loads by submitting your load documents directly to Thunder Funding. Now that you've seen the My Documents tool on our mobile app and the key benefits it provides, we'll jump on over to our web platform to showcase the tool and how it all works. But before we do, if you have any comments or questions, we'd love to hear from you down below. And as always, if this video helped you in any way, we'd greatly appreciate a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to the channel and click the bell. Once logged into your account, open the My Documents tool available on a left navigation menu under the subsection labeled Tools. Once the tool opens, the resemblance to our mobile app interface is immediately obvious. This is intentional, so that once you know one platform, you know the other. You'll see the folder structure and uploaded documents are fully synchronized between platforms, which makes this tool great for multi-device use. The insurance liability document that we uploaded earlier in this video appears in our carrier documents folder. Similar to our mobile app, you will see that you can also send and perform other actions. Next, the fuel receipt we uploaded is also nicely stored in the Illinois to Texas folder, just like it was on the mobile app. Opening the folder load three, we can see the documents that were added specific to the load that we booked earlier in this video. Should you need to get paid faster, submit your documents to Thunder Funding. And should you need to see specifics about the load, click the more options icon and proceed to the load. We hope you enjoyed this video about our user-friendly and flexible My Documents tool that can help make your business more organized. Should you need additional help, please visit our frequently asked questions available at help.123loadboard.com. And as always, thanks again for watching and see you next time. Thank you.